Hey guys, John with PukaJohn.com here with a non puka related video. This is going to be an amazing experience for all of us, especially me, because I'm a big fan of Dow Vineyards. The people at Dow called me up and asked me, hey John, we're doing this uh, possible experimentation with Thomas Keller, world renowned chef. I'll get more into that later, but you guys know Dow Vineyards is my favorite. So they said they're going to send me three meals to prepare, six bottles of wine to pair with it. So let me give you a little glimpse right now. Right here, we got a bottle of Dow Sauvignon Blanc Estate, an Estate Chardonnay. We got a Rosé. We got a Pinot from them. Uh, we got their Estate Cab Sauvignon, and then, of course, a bottle of Patrimony, which is just amazing. What we got from, it says right here, TK to go go. Thomas Keller. So welcome to the dinner with George Dow and Chef Thomas Keller. And it goes into this paragraph. I read some of this. We're gonna, there's a dinner introduction, a wine introduction. So we're reading this right now. They sent me, uh, all right, a little carrots, onions and bacon, some fire nice pickled golf prawns. We got some herb spatzel and cocoa risling. Oh, also some dessert, K&M chocolate mousse. And uh, from Bouchon Bakery, which is a Tom Keller uh, bakery that he created and oh, we got Korean chili flakes and some lemon salt. All right, so we're gonna put this together We're gonna read this and I'm gonna get out my sous vide because some of this has to be sous vide and it's gonna be exciting So I will be back shortly. I'm gonna get in my chef clothing and do this. I'm super excited Thanks to the Thomas Keller. Thanks to Dow Vineyards. I love that family and um, Get ready Go ahead. Recording all right good news everyone. All right, so I went through the uh, pamphlet that they gave us with it. They had some uh, links to where uh, what I was going to do in the beginning of this was show you every detail and what you have to do. They got links to Thomas Keller showing you how to do it. So I can put those up and you can figure it out yourself. All right, so the good thing is it's made to be easy. So, and this is a beta test for the two brands Thomas Keller, Dow Vineyards, pairing food. But the important thing is bringing food to your house and making it super simple to make. Yourself. So this is like a restaurant experience. I mean, it's made by Thomas Keller. So check this out. What do we got here? So here we've got What we did first come over here. So you don't have to sous vide. It comes sous vide and you're heating it and boiling Which is pretty much sous vide -ing. Same thing, but I was thinking traditional sous vide to where we uh, uh, Put it in ourselves. All right, so now here we go with the uh, there's the vegetables and bacon and the cock riesling and now what else we have? The Gulf prawns. Uh, where? Oh, that's a thing over there I'm going to show you in a sec because that was no cooking involved. And what's this called? The spatch? The, uh, what do you call this again? The, show me. Okay. This is the herb uh, spatzel. Okay. So you free. And go ahead. Back to me, buddy. So what you do is uh, you don't have to do the, this extra step that just like browns it a little bit, crisps it a little bit. You know what my job is? I'm not a cook. The beautiful lady is a cook in this house. My job is to open the bottles of wine that we're going to pair with this. So along with the pairing that they suggested is a Dow Sauvignon Blanc and uh, a Pinot Noir by Dow Sauvignon Hills Vineyard. Come over here and I'll show you the, um, not here, and take you to our tasting room. That's what I'm good at. Uh, the fire and ice pickled golf prongs. Come check this out. So with that, we're going to go ahead and get this going. Here, get this out of here. And these are the pickled prongs. You sprinkle that all. So again, if you want a detailed uh, uh, video to show you how to make it, it's really simple, but I'm going to put it in the link. I'm going to enjoy this and give you my feedback on this. So we're going to pick a couple wine glasses. We'll be back in a second. Go ahead and pause that and be right back to you. All right, so we finished our stuff. We're gonna go into just tasting, all right? Because all the instructions, like I said, there's an intro by George now. There's an intro by uh, Thomas Keller. Do, do I really need to be wearing this right now? And I didn't do any of the cooking. The beautiful lady, lady did over here. And, but it's promo to my new lounge, HKH Unwind. And we will get to that in another video. All right, so what are we starting with? The fire and ice shrimp. No, that's okay, don't worry about it. I guess it's memorized. What we're pouring right now is Sauvignon Blanc. In the Adelaide district of Paso Robles, Dow Vineyards, my favorite place on earth. All right, let's go here. So we're gonna start with this first. Okay, yeah, we're doing the fire and ice uh, pickled gulf, gulf prawns. Okay, do this in a little cheers first. Thank you for doing cheers. all the work here in this. I just yeah. poured the wine, love you. Oh, 
stick into this because I don't want to make the video go long. Yeah. So Thomas Keller said in his video, these are the biggest size, they're like a size 10, is that what they're called? Mm -hmm. Size 10? I think they're size mm. Okay, what do you think? Very good. I really like Can I try it? No. <laughs> that stupid dryer is going to keep doing a whole song and dance, so duh. We know you're finished. Alright, so. Perfect time. Mm -hmm. Okay, how did it pair with this? White goes with shrimp, traditionally, what people like to say. Right? Really so good. we'll eat this slower. Can we move on to the next plate? Yeah. I'll do a little pours for you here. Put your glass there. We'll do that. And you want to come in and get this, my man? Get these two plates. This, these are three plates in one, right? And this is the, uh, do you want to read them off? Is the top of reasoning? Mm-hmm. Okay, what's the next one? What are the vegetables? I want to pour this. Get this, we're going to put this with a Dow Pinot. Apple, wood, smoked, bacon, glazed vegetables. Nice. Get a little Pinot. Pinot is a lighter of a red. I hope I use the right glasses for this. I mean, I'm, I'm more of a Cabernet Sauvignon drinker, Cab Franc. You can get all this stuff at Dow, by the way. Cab Franc that they have. They have uh, uh, Merlot, obviously. They've got, uh, said that I'm sweating. They got Grenache. They blend them all together, so it breaks up there. Cheers. Cheers. And that's spatzel. All right, I'm gonna try spatzel first. What I already it? tried it, it's really good. What is it? Do you like car carbs? I think, like, I think it's carbs, I don't know. There's corn in there? It's like pasta. Yeah. Mm. But you grab it really good, which they said you don't really have to, but you can. It just looks better. Mm hmm We'll go on to the bacon and vegetables. So a couple of nice fatty pieces of bacon cut at a good amount, so it's like meaty, fatty. And go in with a little carrot in there. I'm gonna try the chicken. That's cock reels, cock reels, not chicken. Mm. We're supposed to go get a cock bow bed, which is cock bow and wine, right? Yeah, but I don't think this one's cock being chicken. This is <laughs> really good. Try it. Mm. So we're gonna also get some poisson on the next one, right? Are mm. we? Yeah. So was it easy for you to cook? Because it, really? it was easy. Boil the water and put them in the water for 15 minutes and then just brown the whatever this is called. So they come cooked mm -hmm. and you're just like heating them with the, uh, with the sous vide method. Yeah. Which is just 15 or 14 minutes. Yeah, that's about how long it takes. And then you can brown them if you want. If you want, it's optional. This is so good. And this so. is already ready. So you cook all the time. You will either do a full on course where you're slaving for like two hours or you'll whip something up. You got the kids going like, back yeah. to school, you work for hookajohn.com as well, they're all the retail orders. Don't tell anyone that's customer service right <laughs> um, Not a joke. And um, yeah, and you like to do your own personal things too, right? So you can whip things up yeah. that takes off. She's exceptional by the way, not everyone is like her. So she can do everything from whipping things right up and going full blown, like she'll make, uh, your chicken is kind of like this cock Yeah. that you make. Oh, but um, this is really good, I like it a lot actually. Okay. It tastes good, it was quick and easy. Quick and easy, for yeah, somebody super easy. experienced. I mean, we've never done it before and I thought it was very easy. Maybe because we're always in the kitchen, so. Hmm. <laughs> I never order chicken in a restaurant, never. It's good. Because it's not dry. At all. I like the mushroom. With the, what kind of sauce is it? I don't know what sauce. What does it say? Like a... It's a, so the herbs, that's all apple, wood, bacon, it's all together, glazed vegetable. Um, I don't know what the ingredients are. That's yeah, what Tom Keller put together yeah. for you. I'm going to go back to the fire and ice friend. Can you go back and forth? try it too. We could have spaced it out a little better to have this first. Mm -hmm. While you're cooking, we almost did actually broke the glass over there earlier, so we kind of messed up the program. But very it's, good. A, it's like being in a restaurant. It's actually very good. Like I can't believe how good it is. For something that just 
Yeah. Comes in a box in the I, mail. I wasn't like I was excited, but like I was worried it wasn't gonna work out. But it's actually perfect. Yeah. Um. So that's the point of it. In watching the videos, they want to bring something together. Again, this is the beta. If this is the beta, how awesome is it gonna be when they perfect it? Um, at first we were overwhelmed. They told us it was going to be super simple, so I'm like, alright, super simple. And then I got the boxes and showed you guys earlier, and then like reading the instructions, and then <clears throat> I'm like, this is going to be hard. It's not. But I do feel like we No, have, it's not hard at all. If you, you could make this plate, you could make this plate, yeah. you could make this one and this one. But how long would it take you? Oh, it'll take hours. Yeah. It would take yeah. hours to prepare this yourself. And then all the cleaning after. Yeah, all the pots and pans and stuff. This is just like the boiled water and then um, saute. Uh, saute. All right, I think that's it for now. I definitely want to thank, I don't know what else I want to say. Obviously, Dow Vineyards, my favorite winery in the world. These two fridges are filled with Dow Vineyards. Yeah, we'll get to the expo. I probably have two non Dow bottles in these fridges. <laughs> um, Puka Expo Worldwide coming up um, October 8th and 9th in Vegas. That's only five weeks from now, so we'll get this video up. I'm going to bring you two more of these videos too because they're going to give us two more other pairing. Yeah. And what I love pairing with is the wine. So this is supposed to be an everyday dinner. Yeah. This first one. This is just the everyday, no occasion. Then we have like a big uh, weekend dinner coming, and then we have a special occasion one coming. So look forward to those. Get all your cookie stuff. I should have had a hook at least in the beginning. Remember that regal that George gave? The nice custom regal. I want to put it right there nice so in the nice next video. video. At least so they see a video. So maybe people who are fans of say Thomas Keller, uh, Chef Thomas Keller, and and Dow Vineyards uh, stumble across this, they can be like, who is this guy? Who is Hookah John? What is HKH? Unwind Hookah Lounge in Lake Forest. It just opened. You guys should go there. And uh, Hookah Expo Worldwide. So that's it. End this out. Just come and get one last shot. One last shot of this. You notice how tender the chicken is? Yes, Very I do. Very tender. But see, you're good enough. You make your chicken like that too. Like, you don't not even not need the same. Yeah. Really Bacon, uh, carrots, onions, mushrooms. Yeah. If you have to do this, it take like half a day. <laughs> and I like the way Tom, uh, Chef Keller, Chef Thomas Keller was. Kind of slow in understanding uh, or articulating how you make this. Hmm. You think anyone can do it, or you have to have some skills? I mean, you do have to have some skills, but it's not that hard. If you prepare time. what? If you're good enough to like fry up some eggs and make some <laughs> pasta at home, you can do this. Hmm. I mean, could I have done it without you? Yeah, you? so easy. You just have to boil some water. Because I don't. Um, I don't really cook. I'll grill a steak, but yeah, I, I could fry eggs, make an omelet, basic stuff like that. I could have done it, right? You could have done it for sure. But there's no way I could have done this from scratch. No, that's gonna take more skills. A lot of time. <laughs> All right. And a lot of time. But anyway, oh. thank okay. you. Thank you. Thank you, Dow Vineyards. Thank you, George. Thank you, uh, Thomas Keller. And um, we're gonna finish this. So thank you for watching. Cheers. Action. I want to do a little wrap up to that video and uh, bring in Chris, he's our chef here, chef at HKH Unwind. And um, hey, do you compare yourself to like Thomas Keller or anything? Yes. No, 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 no. not yet. I, not feel, yet. I feel like you're, you're kind of the Thomas Keller. No, no, it's <laughs> Yeah, you got to raise your voice a little bit. Right, right. right. We're getting ready to no. open up at the HKH Lounge and I want to tell you what I got. I got this like free prepared meal from Thomas Keller, I got a couple of bottles of wine, and I poured you a little bit of the Sauvignon Blanc from Dow Vineyards. And the reason I'm telling you about this is because you've been to a Thomas Keller restaurant, right? Yes, Which one? sir. Uh, French Laundry. French Laundry. Yep. And you've recently been to Dow. 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 What's in here right now? Yeah. What did you think of that? Oh, it was beautiful. Yeah. Um, yeah. The whole property is beautiful. Uh, the you know everyone there super. Super helpful with the menu. Uh, I mean, it was really comparable to larger name wineries like in Napa. Yeah. That, all right. And what about um, the French Laundry? That yeah. experience, that food experience. Oh, that was that was wild. Like in a good way, wild. But it was honestly really good. If you ever get the chance to make it up there, right. I would definitely. I've been to Ad Hoc. Did you go there? No, I didn't. Ad Hoc is another uh, Thomas Keller restaurant.
restaurant as well. Um, now there is a, a little bit of a difference maybe in the atmosphere, I think. I haven't been to French Laundry, but I was going to tell you about what we did today, and everybody already saw it on this video, where uh, Thomas Keller sends you a pre prepared meal, sous vide style. So it's already cooked. I thought I was going to have to okay. sous vide it myself. So but you just take like lots of boiling water, stick it all in there, like three different bags, and then they get a cold um, plate too, which is the um, fire and ice uh, bit of shrimp, which is amazing. And we pair it with a couple of Dow bottles, and I'm going to get more. So that was the casual every day with the chicken. You just, you don't even need to bite. You just pull it right off the thing. And you said everything was... So I felt like at home I was eating at a restaurant okay. and um, this would have taken hours to prepare every little detail of everything. The seasoning on the chicken or the seasoning is a cream sauce, sure on the seasoning, uh, mushrooms on the side. Um, they had a spats, uh, I think that's how you um, I'm not sure what it was. Actually it's like carbs, I'm pretty sure it was like fried pasta almost, I don't know. Um, and then the other side was uh, uh, like uh, grilled or steamed vegetables with uh, chunks of bacon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's all in this video, everyone saw it. So we're gonna go take their survey in a little bit, we as in me and Renee, and um, they're gonna have to ask us some questions as to how uh, we would rate this experience and you would do it at home. But right off the bat, I'll tell you, it is something that you would do at home because. Um, there's a restaurant experience. We go out to restaurants to get the full service. At home, you may not be able to um, make this type of meal, yeah. but the way they sent it to us, you're just like, I'm eating at a great restaurant at home, and it yeah. took me like, I don't know, 15 minutes to prepare. That's the boiling time. Yeah. yeah, that's the boiling time. 15 minutes or so, 14 minutes, whatever. Okay. Um, prepare some plates, pour a couple glasses of wine. I just wanted to tell you about it. Now I'm yeah, jealous. Yeah. <laughs> well, see, watch the video when it comes out and uh, the other videos. And then for everybody else watching, I said I was going to cross promote. So this is the lounge right here. This is HKH Unwind in Lake Forest, California. Again, big thanks to Dow Vineyards, Thomas Keller, and um, we'll do something like this and I'll bring it in. So we can actually bring like a French laundry or a Napa Valley or a Paso Robles experience right to our house. We can do it here too. And um, I think we great. Oh, what about, check it out. We don't have a kitchen here where we serve food, right? We don't prepare food, we don't cook food. Can we boil water and make these? That'd be amazing. I guess, yeah. Let's turn this into I mean, a high end restaurant. What are we making or stirring our coals in it, right? Just the heater, start coals. Use the same thing, yeah. boil water, throw these in. <laughs> All right, uh, Chef Keller, um, I'll be in touch because I think you just made something awesome for us happen. All right, that's it. Thank you guys. Thanks again, everyone. Bye.